the Spirit of God says, in the year 2020, in an East African country, the rivals and the political enemies of a serving vice president will work tirelessly to have him either fired from government or arrested. This is a campaign of humiliation and elimination of the one whom the Lord has chosen. I have spoken about this personality in the past and his assignment for the nation concerned. I saw in the spiritual realm that if the leader of that nation betrays this man, God will cause all of his liquors to be reversed by those who will come after him. This is what God has shown me. God wants a praying president with a praying wife at the state house of the country concerned. This is what God has preferred. Will those in power choose the one that God has chosen? Are the people in the nation concerned going to choose the one that God has chosen? I see demonic altars that were erected by the founding fathers of the concerned nation fighting tirelessly against the arrival of this man. It is mainly because of the wife of this man that the demonic altars are fighting against the arrival of this man. The wife is before God Almighty and his angels like a firebrand. The demonic princes of that nation actually fear the wife more than the husband, intercessors of that nation, and those who are beyond that nation must pray for God's will to prevail. Hallelujah. It's a very clear message about an East African country.